Have you ever spent hours rigging and animating different characters in Blender? You probably have. And you know how time consuming that is. But the thing is, you don't have to always do this, because AutoRig Pro Animation Library is here to help. This is a Blender add-on that I would say is a vault of ready-made character animations that can apply to your own models and characters with minimal effort. And the interesting thing, it is built on the popular AutoRig Pro rigging system, so you know this is gonna be reliable. But how does it exactly work? AutoRig Pro Animation Library provides a library of 150 human animations, covering a huge variety of actions. You know, from walks, to runs, to fighting moves, dancing, and more. All these animations are designed to work in any human-like 3D model, which you can rig using AutoRig Pro. Essentially, once your character is rigged, you can apply an animation right away, and the add-on will handle the heavy lifting behind the scenes. I mean, it is built to be really user-friendly and time-saving as well. So even if you're not an expert animator, you can get your characters moving in no time. One of the coolest things about the add-on is the sheer variety of animations included. It is not just basic walk cycles or idle poses, though you will find those too. But generally speaking, you will get a bit of everything. If you want combat sequences, there are punches, kicks, dodges, and even fancy moves like backflips and roundhouse kicks. But how about some flavor or fun animations? Well, you will find different dances, from hip-hop moves to a goofy shopping cart dance. In addition to reactions like getting hit or knocked down, and everyday actions such as climbing stairs or checking a phone. The library even covers some imaginative scenarios, like an orc slumbering walk cycle, a zombie's run, and a drunk stumble, which shows how diverse the motion catalog is. In other words, you can animate a wide range of characters and have them perform both realistic and quirky actions right out of the box. Another big feature is how seamlessly this animal works with AutoRigs Pro system. As I said, the animation library was built using the AutoRig Pro rig, so naturally, it requires the AutoRig Pro add-on, I mean to be installed and up-to-date. And the good news is that it is kept compatible with the latest Blender releases and rigging standards. For example, a recent update added support for both APOS and TBOS characters, which means you don't have to worry about the model's respos. And this update included all the new animations, ironing out the previous issues. Using the animation library is straightforward. Even if you're fairly new to Blender, the add-on is designed to slide right into the typical character workflow, and here is a quick highlight of how you can use it. First, make sure that your 3D character is rigged with AutoRig Pro. Then you can add a preset human rig from the library file. It includes both APOS and TPOS versions, so choose the one that matches your model's default stance. Then, import or append the rig into your scene and align your model's character to it. Scale the model so that it fits with the rig's proportions. And by the way, the library provides a white mannequin figure, which you can use as a reference, but you can delete it once the model is in place. Using AutoRig's Pro tools, you combine your character's mesh to the rig. In other words, assign weights so the mesh moves with the bones. This step is about basically attaching the model to the armature so it can be animated. Now for the fun part, simply select one of the 150 animations I mean from the library, and apply it to the rig. Hit play and right away, your character will start performing the action, whether it be a run, a dance, or a fight move, right there on the Blender timeline. And because these are regular Blender actions, you are free to tweak any keyframes, adjust the timing, or even blend multiple animations together using the NLA editor. This means you can customize the motion as much as you want after applying it. That's really all there is to it. In just a few steps, a static model goes from a T-pose or maybe an A-pose to a fully animated character, and the add-on basically takes care of the technical grunt work, letting you focus on the creative side, which is the most important thing. And by the way, the add-on isn't just a one-trick pony. It fits nicely into different production pipelines. If you're using Blender for game development or other interactive projects, you will be happy to know that it plays well with exports. Since it runs on the AutoRig Pro, you can export your rigged characters and animations to FBX or GLTF using AutoRig Pro's export module, which will help you bring it to any game engines such as Unity, Unreal, or Godot. I mean, the animations you apply aren't locked inside Blender, 
so you can take them wherever your character needs to go. So if you want to give it a shot, you will find the necessary links in the description down below. And there you have it guys. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also, please subscribe to the channel to receive more videos like this. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one.